Hello friends, in this video I will be covering a information gathering section and in this I will be showing uh, some basic tools which Kali provide. So power on your Kali machine and also turn on your Metasploitable machine. let it boot up so in this uh, video I will be covering the basic tool of information gathering called Dimitri it helps it helps us to get some DNS name servers and subdomain details from the website we are testing and it also uh, scans for open ports uh, on the server and give you a list of all available open ports or if the ports are being filtered so i am going to pause the video so kali is up and running so log in Going to your account. There we go. Uh, let's see if Metasploitable is also running. MSF is also up and running. So in the applications folder applications menu information gathering and the first tool which we see is Demetri so click on that it will show us the how help uh, about the Demetri how to use and what uh, other uh, tasks the uh, tasks that we can provide with it so let's do a simple uh, test just type Dimitri so, so I am going to run this against yahoo.com and let's see what we get so, as you can see it is getting some subdomains let it finish i am going to pause the video so now we can see the scan has been finished so let's see what does it find for us from the given domain so first of all the first thing which we get is the host ip the ip address of the domain and after that the who is who is information which give us the <coughs> Regist uh, registration date of the domain and other details and uh, after that we get the name servers here we can see that we have five name servers for yahoo.com after that here we can see the subdomains which, it, uh, which we get from google searches and there are a lot of subdomains and after that there are some emails which uh, it found over the web then the last thing is, is the open ports so here you can see that only it port 80 is open so now we can also s do a similar test which will only scan for open ports on the vulnerable system so for that first we need to know the ip address of metasploitable let's
so the IP address is 192.168.1.31 so let's uh, run Dimitri against uh, it so I will do clear so let's run it against our metasploitable machine Dimitri and IP uh, minus P and B flag minus P helps to scan for ports and B will list the version of the service running on that port then enter the IP address of the metasploitable machine and hit enter and as you can see it is scanning and the following ports are open on the vulnerable machine you can see port 21 FTP and the version and application details are also shown over here and same as same as the case with SSH and other services so this is how you can use geometry for information gathering against your clients uh, I hope you liked it if you have any question do comment below so we can help you so thanks